All right, everybody, welcome back to the Biker Baker Show. And new subscribers, come on in. And if you haven't subscribed yet, please subscribe and help us grow. Um, today we're going to make cookie butter, what did I say? Truffles. Cookie, <laughs> cookie butter truffles. We're using Biscoff cookie butter. If you guys have not tried this yet, oh my goodness. It's very good. Mr. Smith had never tried it before, and he loves peanut butter, and I gave him a little taste of this, and he's like, oh my goodness, that is so good. I could eat that just by itself. Yes. Yeah. Take a spoonful. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. So, um, we're going to use this with some butter and some powdered sugar. Mix it all up, and roll it into balls like Buckeyes, and dip them into white chocolate, and sprinkle them with the Biscoff cookies. These are little individual packs, but I'm going to chop them up and uh, sprinkle those on top of the cookies after I dip them into the white chocolate. And this is the white that we're using, vanilla Kroger coating, not almond bark. All right, here we go. That ought to be good. Yeah. I've already took the lid off of this because, you know, we tasted it. And it's yummy. Mm-hmm. <laughs> Why did I not know about that before? <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> I had a customer tell me one time about it, and I was like, cookie butter? That they would get at uh, Trader Joe's. I don't know. It wasn't Biscoff, but it was another kind of cookie butter. But this is what we've got. Good stuff. And I'd never had a Biscoff cookie, so I opened one of those packs and we tried those. They're good, but not as good as this butter, though. They'd be good spread on that, though. <laughs> yeah, we'll sprinkle them on it. I hope you guys are liking the recipes we're, we're getting. I will say that pecan cheesecake pie. That, Yum. That was killer. I said, that's what my sister used to make all the time. That was her signature pie. I'm pretty sure you'll be making that again. I'm pretty sure. Probably this weekend. Maybe. <laughs> <laughs> my brother loves pecan pies. I may have to make him one of those. He'll probably like that one, too. Because he likes cheesecake. Yeah, I think that's even better than just a regular pecan pie. Mm -hmm. I'll give that there to the dog. She'll like that empty jar. Oof, oof, I didn't save none for oof, her in oof, it, though. Oof, oof. <laughs> Not you. <laughs> Not you. All right. So a 14-ounce jar of the cookie butter and a stick and a half of room temperature butter. Oops. Yeah, don't put the paper in it. Yeah, not this time. <laughs> and then... Any some... Nella? No, some powdered sugar. It'll be about a pound and a half probably. So we're just going to start with a little bit. And you just have to feel it to see where you can actually get the balls made and roll. Just like you do with the Buckeyes. And I've never made these before. So, I mean, how can they be bad? Yeah. <laughs> You're just going to have to get in there with my hands, though, because that's the only way you can get this stuff mixed up. With that peanut butter, I mean, that's good with that. Yeah. All right. Anybody else enjoying this beautiful weather we've been having? 56 degrees during the day, 23 at night, but, you know, I'm not out running around at night, so I can deal I with it. I think tonight's only going to get down to 46, so. Yeah. I can take it. Mm-hmm. We're getting down to the days of, oh, stick my arm right in it, of my retirement. I'm ready. Me too. <laughs> One of the girls I worked with today, she said, how many more days left? I said, I don't know. I haven't been counting them. I said, do you mean days of working days or just days all together? And she said, just all days. 
And uh, I said, I don't know. She said 65. She, <laughs> she's already counting. They trying to get you out of there? <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> well, you know, my job is a prime job. There's not very many people even wanting it anymore. Used to when I first started, it was always older men on the window because that was the retirement job. Nowadays, you can't get anybody working. Nobody wants to work it. Nobody wants to work. The window. I wouldn't want to. It's a lot anymore. With the way the tracking numbers are and stuff. Oh, my goodness. A lot to remember. Well, people come in and they get these uh, texts and alerts and saying, they ordered something and they told them that it was at the post office. Well, it is, but it's back here in bags. And but the the uh, the emails and stuff tells them to come and pick it up. But it's not sorted yet. So there's a lot of scams going out there too, where you get in text. There is a lot of scams. I was getting them every day there for a while at Christmas time. <laughs> Last week we probably had about thirty come in. We're a pretty good size office, so we get a lot of people. I'm like, we can't deliver your package. You need to contact. Yeah. No, I don't have a package, so. <laughs> Pay 30 cents so we can re-deliver it. Yeah. Yeah. No, guys, don't ever do that. It's a scam. They're just going to get your credit card number and uh, get you get into your bank account. Yeah, and they'll take more than three, 30 cents. <laughs> yeah. That's just the beginning. And we have had people, like, if you ever going to do a passport and you're going to do your application online and bring it in, you know, and get it done, because we have to finish them for the first-time passports, um, do not pay anything online. I've had a few people come in, and they have already paid money online, and that's not how that works. So don't fall for that one either. All right, I think we got it about right since so I get all this powdered sugar in it. And it feels about right. Ooey gooey mess. Yeah, not not the mess anymore. But it will taste good. Uh huh. Getting that powdered sugar working. Mm -hmm. Now, is this something you can freeze? Um, we have frozen them before. We have frozen the Buckeyes. Yeah. So. Is this kind of like the same thing as Buckeyes? Yep. It's got the same ingredients in it. Well, that'd be good. <laughs> Mr. Smith loves his treats frozen. He don't mm -hmm. want to eat them all right now, but he wants to, uh. Sometimes I like pie frozen. Yeah. Take Depends some on what, what it is. That pecan cheesecake would have been good for us. Yes, it would have. <laughs> I took it to work all but one piece. Well, two pieces. One piece that we ate on camera, and then I saved him a piece, and he just ate it. And uh, probably thinking, wish he would have put the rest of it in the freezer. Mm -hmm. <laughs> but I knew if it was here, I would eat it. I've been trying to do good. <laughs> Yeah, because I'm always making this stuff. I know. Woo! Woo! Didn't go nowhere. Killing me, small. <laughs> All right, so we're going to roll these balls up, and I'm going to melt the vanilla, and uh, we'll be back and uh, show you what we're doing when I get these all done. All right, I got the vanilla bark melted in this bowl right here. So I'm going to take one of these or a few of these and dip them. I made 35 is how many I got. So Wow. Yeah, it's a lot, huh? Yeah. So I'm going to dip them right down in there. They're still running off. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Ooh.
And then for Valentine's Day, guys, you can uh, put some red and white sprinkles or something on top of these. Oh, yeah. Yeah. A red food coloring in your chocolate? In your white, yeah. You can make it red. So I've got some of these cookies in this baggie. I'm just going to smash them up. Take out my frustration, which I have none. On these cookies. Not even from work? No. It's all good anymore. You're on the downhill climb. Yeah. So, Mr. Smith's cup I made. Don't pick on me. And it's a pick in the back because it's a guitar. Nice heavy cup. It's ceramic inside. I like it. <laughs> I don't like metal cups. Metal inside. And I'm just going to sprinkle some of these on top of those. Ooh, wee, look at them. I think them going to be good. That's right fancy there. <laughs> yeah, because I'm all fancy and stuff. You are. Yeah, I am. <laughs> you done kicked it up a notch. Woo. Bam. That's how we do it. <laughs> there can I make a suggestion what can I make a suggestion what take your spoon and clean the bottom of that off and it won't take so long to drip out <laughs> you think I don't know be worth a try with it. Be covering up that. It's all good. Yeah, be covering up that chocolate you want through there. And then after they dry, if you want, you can even sprinkle some of this chocolate, drizzle it over top, make a little decoration, and mm -hmm. you can dye that red or whatever you want. So you think this will work? I don't know. Maybe not. I don't know. <laughs> Still coming off. All right. So we're going to do the rest of these and decorate them a little bit. And I'll show you what they look like when we get done. All right. I've got them all dipped and decorated. These ones I put a little bit. I dyed a little bit of the red or white chocolate and red and then I put some pink and white hearts on them so you see a little bit of those isn't that pretty mm -hmm. and Mr. Smith put a couple of these on this plate in the freezer <laughs> <laughs> and they're stuck okay did they freeze that quick yeah wow it wasn't very long was it mm -mm. all right we're gonna try it oh Got to be good. It is good. Mm. Very <laughs> rich, though. I mean, like, you know, like a Buckeye is, this is more. Like, it's a truffle. It's really smooth and stuff, but I don't know if you could eat very many of these. That might be a good thing because they're so delicious. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Would they, they have been good with nuts in them, maybe? Some pecans? Pecans? Uh, I don't know. Maybe. I don't know. How bad could that be? Truffles don't have nuts, though. They're smooth. Yeah, but, you know. Yeah, I know. You're nutty. I tweak it. I know. Here, try this. Woo. They're good, but they're really rich. That's really good. <laughs> wow. Yes, they are. Mm. So, guys, if you like this kind of stuff, you like the cookie butter or Buckeyes, then you'll love these. So, mm. very quick and easy. 
And you can decorate them however you want. Like St. Patrick's Day, make them green. Yeah. <laughs> Whatever. Whatever your little heart desires. Mm, that was good. <laughs> he ate the rest of it. It was good. <laughs> All right, guys. Like, comment, share, subscribe, please, and help us grow. And thanks for watching the Biker Baker Show. Peace out.